I, I think we got a peak of closing statements on oh, yeah. cross examination, and the peak of the court, and, and that peak was, they they're going to play it. This is not a he said she said against Johnny and Amber. This is a she said versus everyone else. Here yep. is the guy from the trailer park. He said this. He's lying. Here's this another person. liar He's on lying. the stand. Here's is another back. liar on the stand. Right. Everybody's lying for Johnny. So you could and I, I thought that was she 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 let us peek behind the curtain and say we're well, closing hard. Again, right? With all of the lies, right? And we're going to say to believe her, that means you can't believe these 50 people. So that that's where it seems like they're going with close, which I think is going to be extremely effective. It doesn't come down to whether you believe Ms. Heard or you believe Mr. Depp. This case comes down to whether you believe Ms. Heard or you believe Mr. Depp, Christy Dombrowski, Sean Bett, Malcolm Connolly. Travis McGivern, Starling Jenkins, Keenan Wyatt, Dr. Kipper, nurses Debbie Lloyd and Aaron Filotti, Tara Roberts, Ben King, Kate James, Kate Moss, Dr. Colber, Morgan Knight, Morgan Tremaine, officers Melissa Sines, officers Tyler Haddon, officer William Gatlin, and Beverly Leonard. It's not about Amber Heard versus Johnny Depp. It's about Amber Heard versus everybody else. Powerful stuff. Powerful stuff. And again, like I said, we've been saying this because it was obvious that's the way to go, right? And we've been saying this since day one of the trial. It's Amber Heard versus everyone else. Not Amber. Amber Heard versus Johnny Depp. You'll hear a lot of people saying, oh, they were both bad to each other. But Amber Heard versus everybody else is like, yeah. There's a lot that's that's a lot of people that's got to be lying.